Yeah, this is a question to all of you. All of us, as far as I know, had this Vadra story on our tables, all right? At least for two or three years. Econo Economic Times, okay, did a small piece, nobody noticed sure. much, no fallout. But, and none of us did it. I no, wouldn't no, do it. Madhu, I, I have a very good reason why I would not Madhu, do it. All of us shot over Kejriwal's shoulder because he brought the story sure. up. All right, none of us did it. Would you do that story? I would do that story with my biography. I didn't story with that story. And now I don't do reporting. But still, those who have it, those who have it, they said that we have quit pro Q, this kind of thing, which was not the right thing for it. But this thing is right that there is a silence in people's names, to expose them. We play volleyball with allegations and allegations. I'll tell you, I haven't done it because I'm scared. Yes. Straightforward. I'm scared. Am I ready to face Haan. what would come so afterwards for gaya. one story for the rest of my life? <laughs> yeah, but what? No, but what? Arvind ne kiya hai na? Ab dekho India today is being asked for to be investigated. हमें ये नहीं समझना चाहिए कि जो society है, जो news community है, वो हमारे भरोसे है. एक दो. हमारे भरोसे नहीं है. अब वो किसी और के भी भरोसे है. इससे पता चलता है कि हम अकेले जो हैं एक वो प्लेटफॉर्म नहीं है कि तरुण जी जो लिख देंगे वही लोग एक्सेप्ट कर लेंगे रविश ये एग्जांपल है कि इंडिया टुडे आज तक ने ये किया है और ये थ्रेट्स फेस कर रहे हैं कि इनकी इन्वेस्टिगेशन होगी ये भी अगर कोई न्यूज़ ऑर्गेनाइजेशन करता वाड्रा की स्टोरी यू कैन इमेजिन द फॉलोअप ये तो केजर तब वो केजरीवाल के पास गई और वहाँ जाके उन्होंने वो दिए कि कम से कम जो सच है या जो भी है उसको सामने लाए एक आउटलेट बन गए हैं केजरीवाल तो केजरीवाल इस देश में राजनीतिक जो वैक्यूम है उसको भी भरने की कोशिश कर रहे हैं वो जो जर्नलिस्टिक वैक्यूम है इन्वेस्टिगेटिव जर्नलिज्म का उसको भी भरने की कोशिश कर रहे हैं तो हमको लगता है कि कहीं ना कहीं जो जिम्मेदारियाँ थी चाहे चौथे स्तंभ की हों चाहे राजनीति वो पीछे चली गई हैं और केजरीवाल जैसा एक सामान्य सा आदमी वो सामने आ गया are you more wary of doing stories like that? It's it's your, you've been burnt. I I I no. You, I, no you, I, 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 Kerala I, I, has been careful to stay away from Varna's story. I have story. been both burnt and I've been illuminated and affirmed. Today, this this state and this system has brought, and I'm I'm glad for that. They brought Kejriwal to a point where he has nothing to lose, and so he's blowing the whistle right, left, and centre. And I think, in the immediate current, it may be crazy and alarming, but if we step back and look at the at Indian historical uh, process. What is happening is going to be very, very good. Okay. Historically, this process of cleansing is... Well, today, I'll tell you what the cleansing is. Today, all cleansing you see in India, as I was joking with an editor today, is a cleansing out of self-interest. Today, every bun who's blowing the whistle, even the guy who comes to complain to Kejriwal, doesn't come and complain that he comes and complains that he Because there is a neutral um, uh, vendor of this information now, Everybody else can feed off it safely. Mm. So Kejriwal today is the new, neutral vendor of all these exposes. So and he's real I, journalism. Hartosh, complete. Uh, just conclude, please. I don't think there is anything wrong with what we are seeing in when people are blowing the whistle through self-interest. Yeah, it's it's always been true in journalism. It's, it's multiplied to a point where people are losing a certain kind of fear. I think and it started with the Helka. We've seen it with the radio tapes. Once a story is now today out in the public and it has a certain impact, Absolutely. what was done to Tehilka today cannot be, be done, done to again. a media organization again. Absolutely. It will not be done to I India today. Salman me. will not have the guts to we'll, do it. I, I yeah, we we, we will come back for we this. We will do it in different ways. No, it cannot any longer be done and people will not remain silent. And I'll tell you what the historical nature of this place is, that today for the first time, and that's why the alarm is largely among the elite, Today, for the first time, we are seeing a, 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 a very rapid fruition of what the founding fathers set off 62 years ago. Yes. And what they set off was the business of taking entitlement down to the weakest of the weak and yes. the poorest of the poor. And what we are seeing today is that even the weakest of the weak and the poor have to be, believe that they are, they be, uh, they part right. of this country belongs to them and they have they a stake so. in it and they have a right. This, was all, this, the, this, only, this sense of entitlement only belonged to the elite for a very long time. Only Did my class, people of my class believed that this <laughs> thing. And you can see that even in the way today you cannot maltreat people who work in your homes, you cannot maltreat your drivers because the sense of entitlement, and the great credit for this goes to the founding vision of this country, which is what it tried to do 62 years ago. But don't you think ago. that the establishment has not understood that the world So they will pay for it, they will pay, they are paying for it today, they will pay for it. Papa, establishment ko is baat ki, I'm saying that we have to understand 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 that we have to understand
और बहुत ही रोमांटिक रोमांचक दौर से गुजर रहे हैं जो लोग कह रहे हैं कि नेगेटिविटी फैल रही है वो, वो अपने किसी फाइव स्टार के कॉफी बार में बैठ कर दुखी हो रहे हैं वो इस ऊर्जा को एनर्जी को फील नहीं कर पा रहे हैं अगर पॉजिटिविटी नहीं होती तो ये लड़ाई इतनी लंबी सस्टेन नहीं करती वो अलार्म इज ओनली अमंग द एलिट बिकॉज फॉर द फर्स्ट टाइम दे आर नॉट द ओनली होल्डर्स ऑफ एंटाइटलमेंट एंटाइटलमेंट इज गोइंग एवरीवेयर द बिगेस्ट जो कि समझ दे माय नॉट इवन अलार्म दे नॉट अवेयर ऑफ व्हाट्स गोइंग ऑन बट दे विल पे अ प्राइस यू सी इन द एंगर हिस्ट्री विल मेक द पे अ प्राइस कितनी अकाउंटेबिलिटी बढ़ गई कि पहले हो सकता था कि हम किसी के घर जाके चाय पी सकते हैं आज 10 बार सोचेंगे कि उसके घर चाय पीने जाएं कि नहीं जाएं मेरी इतनी अकाउंटेबिलिटी है कल को कोई ट्वीट कर देगा पूछेगा कि अच्छा आप उनके यहां जाते हैं इनके यहां जाते हैं तो ये बहुत अच्छा है कि हम अपने कैरियर के शुरुआत में जितना सतर्क नहीं थे उतना कहीं अब ज्यादा है कि लग रहा है कि बहुत लोग मॉनिटर कर रहा है हमारी अकाउंटेबिलिटी सिर्फ लिखने बोलने की नहीं है जो पर्सनल कंडक्ट है पब्लिक में कहीं शॉपिंग करने जा रहे हैं या कहीं जा रहे हैं कि कहीं आप डिस्काउंट तो नहीं ले रहे हैं लेकिन इन सब चीजों पर एक चेक बढ़ गया है ये अच्छा है इसका रिजल्ट बहुत अच्छा आएगा कि हम थोड़ा थोड़ा डरना डरने लगेंगे ये नहीं कहेंगे कि मैं प्रेस का आदमी हूं तो तुम मुझे इतना डिस्काउंट दे दो ये नहीं हो थैंक यू वेरी मच ये मैंने कभी किया भी नहीं लेकिन होगा भी थैंक यू वेल सी द वेरी फैक्ट दैट पीपल आर फाइटिंग विद इंफॉर्मेशन रादर देन गन्स एज तरुण सेज मींस दैट दे हैव अ स्टेक इन द सिस्टम दे आर फाइटिंग फॉर समथिंग नो नो बट छोड़ दिया और पीपल फाइटिंग अगेंस्ट हिम आर फाइटिंग विद इंफॉर्मेशन मैं तो एक लास्ट चीज मैं कहना चाहूंगा मैं चाहता हूं कि केजरीवाल का ये दौर है कहीं थमे नहीं चलता रहे ऐसा ना हो कि मीडिया पे धीरे धीरे वही चीज इरेज करने लग जाए कि जो आवाज है उनकी और बुलंद हो सलमान के लिए मेरी सलाह है कि वो एक नया ऑक्सफोर्ड इंग्लिश डिक्शनरी लिखें थैंक यू वेरी मच ऑल थैंक यू